Hey guys, what is up, the Neo Cubist here? Welcome to episode 9 of my Minecraft Falling Falling Survival Let's Play. So, in the last episode, we got this beautiful cow spawner created. Um, it functions quite nicely, and uh, we've, we're getting a bunch of cows and a bunch of food. Uh, when we left off, we had some stuff smelting, got a bunch of extra panes, and then over here, we now have access up into our spawner, which is pretty cool. And I'll show you guys how you work, how it works if you missed episode 8. But go and watch that. It's a pretty fun episode. We designed this spawner. Um, I kind of put some trap doors here and then realized that you don't actually need trap doors. But it works just beautifully. And uh, it's kind of cool to have infinite cows, which means infinite leather armor. So I figure since we have some armor now, we're going to go up to the very top of this world. And um, obviously make the ladder all the way up. Um, so I think that the world has gone to max height now. I... Well... Here's the thing, the only reason I know that, and it's kind of cheating in a way, but to get good screenshots, I have to go into spectator mode, uh, which I can't give myself things or anything, but I can fly, and uh, that's how I get all the cool shots that you guys see, uh, like the one for this video that you guys saw. I assume it's going to be showing off the fact that this, this pillar is now, like, ridiculously big. I mean, I'll show it to you guys. I'll see, like, I press F3 and N. It'll put me into spectator or creative mode. If you guys can see, <laughs> this thing has become quite large. Um, it's reached the top, I assume, since there's no more blocks really forming. And our ladder makes it all, all the way up to, like, right there. So we just need a few more ladders. But as you can see, this thing is absolutely massive. And that's our base, if that gives you an idea. And then our cow spawner is over here. So I hope that doesn't feel too cheaty. I'm not going to ever give myself anything, but if I need to fly uh, to get a thumbnail, that's how I do it. So if you ever see that, like, in my chat, I have, like, game mode, uh, survival, or something like that, it's just because I needed to fly and get a thumbnail. But before we do anything, we're going to need to make a bunch of ladders, <laughs> like a bunch of ladders, and then after that, I think we should be good. We're going to go all the way to the top and uh, maybe start a block farm or something. But I kind of want to just explore up there um, on top of the world. It would be nice if we could hang off the edge, but unfortunately it won't really let you do that. Um, if you start hanging off the edge, it gives you poison, and uh, it's not my favorite thing. You guys said there's a really easy way to delete it. I might go and do that uh, for like another episode or something, because uh, I'm not a huge fan of the poison, although I do understand why it's there. It's not like I don't understand why it poisons you. It's because you're not supposed to be there. But for my purposes, I kind of like to like hang off the edge and look around, so I may remove it. Um, nothing wrong with the map. I love this map. I think it's my favorite custom map that I've ever played, personally. Okay, so I don't want to bring anything except like what I'm going to need. I may make another iron shovel. You know what? Yeah. I'm going to make another iron shovel. Obviously, I should have put up this pickaxe. Uh, so we're going to make an iron shovel, and then we have this pickaxe, and we should be good. I don't want to bring all my steak, but I want to bring a little bit. So 26 should be good. Uh, we don't need these furnaces. Preparing for the big journey. We also don't need trap doors. Okay, let's get to it. So I'm going to go up this extremely long ladder. You guys always ask me, Neo, how do you zoom in? Well, I have a mod called Optify installed, which allows me to have shaders. And uh, you can press the C on your keyboard. On you have to have Java to get what I have. But you press C. See, like, it disappeared. Uh, but I can zoom in like that. So I'll meet you guys at the top of the ladder. It makes it look really short when you zoom in. But if you look at it, it's actually, like, really, really tall. And it's going to take a bit, so I'm not going to film it. So I, <laughs> as I'm going up this, I realize I don't have any blocks. And because I don't have any blocks, I can't build the ladder to go to the top. So I just went up this whole thing for nothing. I guess I could get some more blocks, but honestly, I'm going to have to do it. I really didn't want to have to fall all the way down. You guys said to waterlog these blocks. I keep hearing the comments, and I agree. Uh, the only problem is, is that it'll flow off the side of the map and make my thumbnails look bad, and I can't have that. I can't have that. But yeah, let me go. <laughs> it sucks. That literally takes like a couple minutes to get up. I think that'll be good. Okay, I'll meet you guys at the top. Gosh dang it. Now, you guys also suggested soul sand elevator, double click space bar. Well, if you hold down the space bar, I'm holding down W. Let's hold down the space bar. It's like the same thing, or double, double W, double W, how many, how many times can I say double W fast switch? W, W, double W, W, double W, double W, double W, double W, it doesn't sound right. You guys also ask me in the comments, you guys, can you say your intro really fast? Hey guys, what is up the new Cubist here? Hey guys, what is up the new Cubist here? Hey guys, what is up the new Cubist here? Welcome to another ep- I could do that all day. Um, I'm trying to entertain myself going up this ladder, but you guys said do a soul sand elevator, well, 
I don't exactly have any soul so soul sand right now. Um, we're getting close to having enough stuff to go up to the nether, which will be nice, but like I don't have soul sand or I'd completely do that like 100%. You think I want to go up this whole thing like this? Nah, I really don't. Okay, we're almost there. Thankfully, we got all the way to the top. That was so disappointing. I was just like, wait, something's not right. And there's going to be a long... How, how many blocks are above this? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. It won't actually be that bad. Unless I encounter sand that knocks me off. <sighs> or gravel. Either one. They're both devious, and they will knock you off your ladder. And it's it's very bad when it happens, because you can die very... Oh, you can die very easily. I know you guys are probably having, like, mad anxiety watching this. Believe me, how anxious do you think I am playing it? Ooh, iron. Oh! <laughs> you see what I mean? It's like, eh, you can't do... Ah! What was that noise? I don't know. Sometimes when I get scared, like, sounds come out of me that just, like, don't sound okay. Sounds like I'm dying. Nope! Ah. Dang it, gravel. You gotta quit that. We've talked about this gravel. That's not appropriate behavior. You're not gonna fall on people's heads anymore, okay? It's gonna keep happening though. It's gonna be really hilarious. I should play with F5 on. Uh, I should play with F5 on. No, that really doesn't help. Okay, is there any more gravel or anything? Not for a while. I think there's some sand really far up there. But yeah, I'm gonna continue doing this for a good bit. I'll cut the camera back when we're getting closer to the top because this is not. Actually, you know, what? I don't want to cut the camera because I feel like if I do, and also. I think there's a bug because the outer layers don't form as fast. I don't know if that's an RNG bug or if it even uses random number generation. I don't know. Uh, Mr. Birdie, if you're watching, though, the outside layer, um, as you can see, it doesn't really fill in as quickly as the inside. I don't know if this is probably just some mathematical thing. I don't know. I don't know anything about math. I'm terrible. I, even, I took statistics class, and I was, like, talking about all these statistical things, and they were completely wrong. And everyone was correcting me. I was like... I took a class about exactly what I'm talking about and I still didn't understand it. So like that's pretty much education. You, you take classes and they teach you about things and then as soon as you're out of those classes, whoop, there goes the info that you'd learned the entire semester or a year, depending on if you're in high school, but I don't know, college isn't much better. I still don't remember, oh, I still don't remember, I know I should break it with my hand, but whatever. And I should break it with my shovel. But, like, you learn all these things in college and in, like, high school. I just forget everything. I still know A squared plus B squared equals C squared, so thank God I can calculate the side of a missing tri- Like, the missing side of a triangle. That's so useful in real life. They didn't teach me how to do anything with my taxes. I even took a personal finance course. And they did- I mean, they talked a little bit about taxes. But, like, that kind of stuff's, like, super important. And it's like, they don't- Like, what? And it was in college. You just- uh. Okay, that's not fair. You'd think that- in those classes, you'd get taught about things that matter, but like, I don't know. Maybe that's just an American thing. Like, America, I know, doesn't have the best schooling in the world, but I at least thought that they would let me understand, or it would make me understand things, but... Oh my gosh! <laughs> oh my god! What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> Look at they're having a party up there, my god. Holy crap, I did not expect that in any way. Oh my god, that just scared the crap out of me. Oh, I gotta calm my heart rate down, dude. What in the... What the... Just what? Okay, that's definitely a screenshot. I hear a villager. Do you hear that? <laughs> He's like, what? <laughs> what are you talking about? Huh? Huh? Where's the villager? Hold on. I'm gonna go in this mode only so I can take... Oh my god. Only so I can take a screenshot of this madness. What is this, dude? I know I shouldn't go up there and inspect it. I really want to take a screenshot, though. Hold on. I need to... Okay, you know what? We're gonna pretend... We're just gonna play... Okay, so there's a traitor, but he's standing on here and he's invisible. What does he even have? Those are good things. I don't want him to disappear, but... Can, hold on. I know this is a little... Oh, I'm sorry, dude. Please don't tell me he just fell off. Yeah, I totally just... Wait, is he right here? No, I totally just knocked him off. I know it's a little bit cheating, but like... One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. So it's like I did it in survival. I just want to take a couple screenshots, so give me a second, guys. Oh, my God. But yeah, that'll be the screenshot I'm going for, I think. I don't know. We'll see. Let me get back down to my ladder. I'm sorry I had to do... I had to take a screenshot of that. Like, I had to. Like, what? 
I mean, I understand why they're spawning up here. Like, it's the only place... Oh, my gosh. It's the only place that they can spawn. But, like, as soon as I go up here, I don't have any... Oh, no. Oh, dude, I gotta get out of here. We gotta get out of here. Oh, my God. I gotta come better prepared. Hold on. <laughs> I might need one of them swords or something. Uh I can fall. Oh, you can't fall. I was gonna say, I could just follow the side. No, you can't. You're gonna die of poison. Yeah, I definitely need to uh, rethink my strategy <laughs> as far as that goes. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so I need a pickaxe. Or not a pickaxe. I need a sword made of iron. Okay, an iron. Iron pickaxe. Can you guys calm down, please? Okay, they, can, they I think they can actually get to me. So, I, hold on. I need to hurry and quit. Okay, I don't want to use that kind of wood. All right, we'll put up because I want to keep the fancy kinds of wood in case I never like Get to a point where I have and I want to keep some ladders on me in case I get to a point where I never get any, any of the saplings If that makes sense, I think I had sticks in there and I don't even need two sticks I should know these things by now. I play minecraft for a living. I should know these things. Hello cows Welcome to the world How does it feel? Okay, let's go back up to the top there's phantoms, so that could be problematic, I suppose. Come here. Yeah, come over here, dude. Hey, what are you even doing, dude? You're trash, bro. Yeah, that's right. I'd run away, too, if I was you. Freaking garbage. Where are you even at, bruh? Come on. Come on down. Come fight the Neo Cubist. Come on. I'll even walk on the most dangerous part of my world for you. Okay, we gotta get out of there. Okay. Please just... Oh, they're so annoying to attack because they take so long to come back. All right, come on, you can do it. Yep. Okay, you're, I get it, you're so spooky. You're such a spooky phantom. <gasps> oh yeah, you're so spooky, look at that, you did a flippy. <gasps> oh, you're flying upside down. Come on, just come over to me so I can kill you. It's gonna take like two more hits, I bet. <gasps> phantom membrane. Okay. I don't know where the rest of them went, but I'll cut back in if they start to attack me. But I'll cut back when I'm at the top because I don't want to watch myself do this. I wouldn't want to if I was you, so I'll be back. Okay, it's becoming day, and as I climb this ladder, I feel... <laughs> there we go, watch. It'll just, yeah. So if we put slabs at the top, they won't break, but we, what we can do is at the top, which I figured we were closer, but are we closer? We're kind of close. Um, so it's becoming day, so when I get up there, hopefully it'll be a, less, a little less hectic, but as I was going up this, I was thinking about all the bad things that could happen. So those little divots in the world, if a skeleton spawned there and shot us with an arrow, we're toast. So I need to make sure and fill in all those because we could get like roasted and ghosted real quick. And I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to get yeeted off this world because we're really high up here. <laughs> you guys can tell we're extremely high up here. Like <gasps> we're extremely high up here. And uh, yeah, hey guys, what is up? Hey guys, what is up? The new Kimister went a little bit. Neo.exe has stopped working. Okay, let's get up here. Okay, I'm really scared. Okay, so there's not that much bad stuff. Okay. There's a llama up here, which I assume is part of the wandering trader. Okay, we can get yeeted off by a skeleton in like two seconds. We gotta get these guys out. <gasps> oh my god, spider jockey. Oh, god. What? No! What is this? I am so confusion. How did I not die and why is there a hole? What in God's name was that? Dude, I thought I was dead. Did you guys see that? I took no fall damage. <laughs> Thank God for that berry bush, but like Jiminy crack it with a sprick on my spracket. What was that? Oh my gosh. The words you create when you can't use bad words is, um, is just, they're just crazy. Okay, well now I gotta go all the way back up. <laughs> I really thought I was gonna... I hear so many things. I hear so many things. Where are these things? You know what? I don't even know. I don't... I hear a chicken. Dude, where would a chicken be? <laughs> what? We're at layer 162. Why is there a chicken? Okay, what is this? Oh, man. It's like the cave of doom. This must have been... Ah, this is where I put things down. Okay, so there's a chicken here. Does that mean... Oh, an emerald. Not bad. Not bad, Neo. Good find. But yeah, I feel like I could get just straight wrecked in here. I'm trying to figure out where the chicken came from. I hear another spawner, but I don't know. We'll, we'll go back down here if we need be, but I'm going back up. What is that? Ow. Okay, so blocks are just going to fall on my head. It's okay. 
My leather helmet? Why is my leather helmet almost destroyed, but nothing else is? Did that take the 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 the, the brunt of the fall? Was it my was it my head? That's that's obsidian. <sighs> okay, well I have to go down here to get that. Okay, this is a long thing. Hold on, I'll come back when I'm done building up here. This. Oh, iron. Okay, well I'm almost back at the top. I've got three iron, a phantom membrane, and a heart attack. I literally had a heart attack, like... Oh my, what? It's not even dark, dude! It's not even dark, dude! Oh my god, please, quickly, quickly, quickly! My building skills are failing me! Oh my god, what in God's name? Oh my god, stop it! My heart, my heart can't take much more! Oh my god, dude, what on earth? Do, wait, do mobs always spawn up here even when it's day? Good god. Scared the bejesus out of me. Is there, are they still up here? No. Okay, so they just all spawned so they could just give me a freaking heart attack. Dude. Ow. Ow, quit it. Okay, so see the blocks? I guess because this is the build height, you see 256? They can't really fall properly. So they just kind of randomly fill in. But yeah, we're at the top of the world. <laughs> Feels pretty good, don't it? I mean, look, we're at the top of the world. You can't even see the bottom of this bad boy. Can't see it at all. Okay, so things just spawn up here. I guess even during the day. Yeah, get yeeted, kid. Yeah, how you feel about that, creeper? Bye-bye. See you later. Yeah, if I stand on this block right here, I think something... No, hold on. If I stand on this block over here... Then something can spawn in like the very corner, I think over there, right? I don't know. Let me go down a little bit like this, okay? And then we'll just sort of go back up. Let's see if there's stuff up there. I must confirm my hypotenuse. Yes, that is the correct word. I'm going to confirm my hypotenuse. Oh my god, though, dude. That scared them. Yep. So they definitely just... So definitely don't need a low light level. I just can't get yeeted off. Oh my god. I keep saying the word yeet. I keep saying yeet, help me. Okay, you could, you got yeeted. <laughs> it's mainly the Endermen I care about. These guys, oh my gosh, spiders are quicker. You guys are quicker. You guys are quicker. Okay, okay, I get it, okay, I get it. You play Minecraft, I get it, get out of here. Zombies, you, you guys are just, you guys are, you guys are easy peasy. We're getting close to the edge. This is hardcore up here though, like, dude, I didn't. Okay, I need to be careful. It looks like there's just holes. Oh my God. What on earth, dude? Why is there just a giant hole? Well, I have to be sure to not fall in these. Okay, where else is a giant hole? Okay, that's a somewhat giant hole. Okay, we're gonna fill it in. That's a somewhat giant hole. I don't know why these are here. Oh, that's like a freaking huge hole, dude. Look at that. So, <laughs> I guess it's good that we, I guess it's good that we fell in one of them. So that we don't fall in another in the future. So we're going to fill all these holes in. <laughs> so basically what can happen up here is I could make somewhat of an AFK farm. I just have to hold down my mouse and uh, hear me out. I want, I want to hypothesize this with you guys and we'll see if it works in the future. Okay. I was getting, I'm getting real concerned because there's so many of these holes around here. And I don't want to end up in one of them. Falling. Dying. Uh... But yeah, if I just sat here with my my hand on the, the thing like this and just like, well, how long would it take another bl- What? Hello, good sir. Do you have a trade? Would you like a home? I can't build you one up here, but if you come down with me on this nice ladder over here, Mr. Villager, uh, or Mrs. Villager, um, we can go see about getting you a house down here. If you want to follow me, no, over here. No, over there, there's... No, you don't want to go to that area. Trust me. Come over here. Yeah. Why don't you just come over here real quick? Come on. You know you want to. Please, just go down my ladder. No, yes. Yes. That is the right way. No, that is not the right way. Dude, you gotta be careful here. You could fall off so easy. Be careful. Okay, you know what? We're gonna do this. Okay, stop it. Stop it. <laughs> okay, whatever. Uh, this might kill me.
I am sad. I said it might kill me. And by the time we get up there, there's going to be 17 bajillion things. <sighs> well, we didn't have anything crazy on us, but it's still like one of those, dang it, <laughs> things. I, I even said, like, that's going to kill me. And I just still do it. I do that all the time. I'm like, this is going to kill me. And then I do it anyways. And I'm like, what? Wh like, what? Dude, you're stupid. <laughs> you're just stupid, dude. 15 minutes later. <laughs> Why do you do the SpongeBob voice? Okay, so we got two zombies and our all our loot. Okay, good. I was very worried that there would just be like an insane amount of things up here, but it looks like the world has blessed us. I don't know why things can spawn up here. I guess light doesn't work right at the top. And where's our helmet? I guess it disappeared. We also have a bunch of steak. Where's our cooked steak? I need that. Uh, but yeah, I wanted to I wanted to experiment around up here since we hadn't ever really been to the top of the world yet. Um, there is a villager up here, which I wish I could bring him down. And I have a way, like, I could do this. It's just, it's kind of... Oh yeah, I can't build up here. I was going to say I built a little area for him to walk. But I can't really get him to... Okay, okay, this is, this is our chance. Come over here, let me coerce you. Strongly, please go to the ladder, go to the ladder, go to the ladder, go to the ladder. You're like that. Yes! Oh, <gasps> we've got a villager. We've got a villager. Okay, so you're going to go down there and then... Oh, okay, he's going to go down there. <laughs> I guess uh, against his will, he's just going to fall. <gasps> I almost fell off the edge. Um, he's going to go all the way down, I assume, and then be at the bottom. And I guess we'll make it in house. But yeah, I wanted to experiment up here. So if we break these four blocks, how long does it take them to reappear? Okay, so there's a block. So we can sort of make a farm up here. All we have to do is just sort of mine all these blocks and then they'll just sort of appear, I suppose. Like we just like walk around like this and mine resources as we need them. And then there's the, they will just sort of fill in slowly. Um, another option is TNT, but we need a creeper farm. Creeper. Aw, oh, man. So we back in the mine, got our pickaxe swinging from side. I'm done. I'm done. I promise. But yeah, I can just mine these ores and then, I mean, I guess it's somewhat helpful, but we don't really need any of these ores. But it's cool that we can make a block farm up here. I'm trying to wait for it to, oh no, I need to get out of here, dude. Actually, you know what? It's dark. Um, oh, that was, okay. I need to hold my torches. Um, it's getting dark, so I want to see something. I want to see how close mobs can spawn because I don't know. I'd love to make like a defense thing up here, but wait this isn't the corner okay we need to go at our actual corner okay so i'm curious to see how quickly things will spawn i think they'll spawn over there in that corner if i'm standing on this block right here i'll wait for a bit and see if that happens and as soon as i cut the camera two spoders spawn so there's two spiders here okay an enderman <gasps> no please don't kill me enderman i didn't do nothing to you i just i didn't mean to i didn't mean to look at you dude I didn't mean to. Is he gone? He's gonna come up here and just like, just roast us. Okay, so what I should do, actually, you know what, that won't work. Hmm. Actually, you know, it would work. If I go over here and put like some trap doors or something, and then make like a little, I could make a mob spawner so easy, like just level out the floor right below like this or any other floor, like really it doesn't matter. And then just have some water canals. So we could make a pretty banging mob spawner. I want to sit in the corner though. How long does it take for things to spawn? Because they can spawn only in that corner. And then after they spawn in the corner, if they move out of it, there's room for another mob. So if I just sort of sit here and I don't want to look in the corner. No, okay. So they can kind of spawn. I guess they could, I thought they could only spawn like right over there for some reason. Because that's 25 blocks away. I'm going to go mess around with this creeper. Yeah, that's right. I'm a creeper master, if you guys don't know. Good job, creeper. You blew up your only world. All right. Well, we're going to fly off this real quick. I'm going to see if my villager's down here. <gasps> Dude, that's like the second time I totally should have died. Where's the... Is that the... Do you have a job? Dude, he's employed. Good for you. I knew you were looking, but I didn't know you'd find something so quick. Thanks, my guy. I wonder if he became a farmer because there's melons? There's def- Okay, you gotta move, dude. This- One of us has gotta move. Okay, one of us has gotta move. Okay. Yeah. 
Yeah, no, move, dude. If I go down on this, you're going down with me. 100%. Please. Okay. He's, he's being mean. We're going to go down right here. We're just going to go down right here. Okay, what are you doing? Ooh, a bucket of cod. 20 string gives me one emerald. That's not a terrible trade, actually. I was expecting something much worse, but not anything really much better. Okay, well, let's put a torch right here. Um, I want to get something going over here because I don't want him wandering over to the ladder. That's that's just not good for any of us. So we'll put this right here, and then... Mm, we can still access these chests, but it doesn't look the prettiest if we do it like this. Uh, but to be honest with you, I'm not too concerned about how this really looks at this point. Maybe I'll improve it, or I'll, I will improve it in the future, but I just want to make sure that he doesn't wander off into that area. That's not an area the... It's not an area for a villager, let me just say it like that. So he can't get anywhere else. But we now have a villager. And I'm not sure uh, why he became a fo Oh, a fisherman. Sorry. So he's a fisherman. Is it because there's water here? Yeah. Okay, well, tell me about your day. How you been so far? Okay, he doesn't want to talk to us. That's okay. A lot of people don't want to talk to me. But you know what? How are you feeling, my dude? Are you feeling good? Yeah? How would you what, what, quit quit turning away from me? What do you what, what do you want to say? Okay, that's a fair point. I understand what he's trying to say. He's trying to say he's really bothered by the fact that he was you know forced down that ladder. He loved his place at the top, but unfortunately we had to bring him down to our level. Um, but yeah, that was a play on words in so many ways. That was cool. I love seeing what was at the top. Although it did, I don't know why it didn't occur to me that like that could happen. Ooh, wool. How do we get wool? Oh, okay, thanks. Well, at least we have a partner now, I guess. We don't really have a pet villager, seeing as how he's like another person. But we have a villager buddy who's going to hang out with us and keep us entertained. I presume. I don't really know. I guess we'll find out. <laughs> okay, we got leather, this bamboo phantom membrane. That's... No, those aren't in there? Okay. Um, Where'd wool go? You know, honestly, we need more barrels, but I don't remember how to craft them. Hmm. Do you want to show me? I think they were like this, and then this, and this. No. Or is it like this, and then... No? Okay, you know what? Tell me how to do it. Barrel. Oh. Okay. Um, so I'm going to put another barrel right here. You know what? I don't... Well... Uh, no, I don't want it sideways. Okay, we're going to have to break it by hand. Oh no. Yeah, I don't want it sideways. I guess we'll have to place it like this. There we go. So I was gonna put like mob drops in a separate one. So like what else was a mob drop in there? Spider eyes? Yeah, I think that's um like meat and stuff, that's like a passive mob drop, so I'm not gonna consider it that. But like I wanted to have a separate space for those. But these snowberries need to go in there. And then this is a mob drop, but this is like an animal mob drop. Yeah, we're gonna have so many cows. I'm so worried that like something's gonna spawn in here and just blow up my entire world. That's honestly what I'm more worried about than anything else. Because if something just spawned in here, we have no defenses. I mean, we have a sword, but like I'm not prepared to fight things in here in any way or in any capacity. So we'd probably end up dying pretty quick. But that's the fun of the world, right? I'm glad we made it to the top, though, guys. If I haven't said it enough, I really truly am. That was really exciting. I want to go back up there in a minute. We should see how it goes. You know what? It's getting really close to the end of the episode. This is the third one of these I've recorded. I want to go back up to the top for just a minute at least, but I want to craft another helmet. I'm not sure why the helmet broke first. Maybe because it has the least durability? Yeah, it does have the least durability. So, we just need a boop. And then a blop. We should be good. Okay. Alright. Close that, and let's head back up to the top. I'll cut when we're up there. Okay, so it started raining, and I guess we couldn't hear it because I'm just going to peek. Oh, there's not much up here. A chicken? Okay, but I'm, mo I'm most worried about the skeleton. That could be the worst thing in the world because they have range, and I don't. Oh, an acacia tree sapling. Oh! Go ahead and blow up your friends, you idiot. Idiot. Yeah, go ahead. Noob. What? You guys hear that? I just heard another villager. I swear I heard another villager. Where are you, buddy? Oh, he's invisible. He's invisible. Okay, so I was wondering what that was. 
I'm trying to get the leads from it. That's what I really need. Where? Where'd he go? Where? It's like playing... What's that game where people are, like, just saying Marco, po Marco Polo? <laughs> where are you, dude? Okay, he's invisible. Where would I go if I was invisible? Right here. Nope. Right here. Did I kill him? I just want to kill his llamas because then we get leads and that would be helpful. I'm also not sure why there was a chicken up here. I'm a little bit concerned as to why that happened. But uh, another beautiful day in... Oh, that's weird. Another beautiful day in Minecraftia is complete. Anyways, thank you guys for watching episode 9. I hope you guys enjoyed us getting to the top and having a bunch of big scares. I think there's two big ones that I really remember. Falling in that hole literally made my heart sink because I was like, dude, I'm never going to get my stuff back. I could have put water in the hole. I guess it wouldn't have been that bad. Either way, it made my heart stop for a little bit, so leave a like for that, I guess. But thank you guys for watching episode 9. Thank you guys for supporting the series so, so much. I really do genuinely appreciate it. You guys are some of the best people I've ever met. You guys are a great group of people. If you're not subscribed to the channel and you want to see more videos like this and much, much more, be sure to click the subscribe button to be notified when I upload. Also, click that bell because otherwise... That's interesting. Otherwise, it won't tell you when I upload. If you guys want to play this map for yourself, it's the first link down in the description below. Uh, leave a comment. I try to heart every single... Or I do heart every single comment on, on my channel. So that's a pretty fun thing I do. So I do see every single comment, and I take them into consideration. And, uh, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in episode 10, a tutorial or let's play of the survival world. I'm not really sure. But, anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. So as you guys can see, I just realized I'm, I'm do, trying to record some thumbnails and I, I come over here and I'm like, oh, well, the door is open. And then he's just, dude, he's going all the way up. He just, I mean, la they know how to use ladders, I guess. He's gone, dude. Like he's, he's not coming back. <laughs> like, dude, he, bye bye. See you later, dude. Okay. So that's interesting. But yeah, I'll see you guys later. I'm just trying to get a good thumbnail shot for this episode. Uh, but yeah, so what I'll do is I'll go in here. I'll put all my stuff up. Boop, 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 boop. And I make sure to not miss this stuff now. I put all my stuff up. And then I go fly around. I figured out, though, when I'm... And this is like a behind-the-scenes footage thing. So I also put shaders on when I take them. So that we get this nice blue sky. Uh, but when you go too far down, <clears throat> the game kills you. So I have to be very careful. I'm trying to get a thumbnail shot. But, like, guys, it's... Um, it's... It's... It <laughs> like, it's so tall. I have to go, like, this far away. And, like, it just looks, like, all grayed out. But, like, dude, that is so freaking tall. I'm trying to get it, you know, angled in. Because on the left side, we have the falling, falling, like, banner. So, it's really is, it really is, like, an art form, kind of. And, uh, hopefully that looks good. Anyways, I'll see you guys later. Bye.